Well, hello and welcome to this exercise on upper bound, lower bound, uh, distance, speed, and time. Uh, an IGCSC, GCSE uh, revision exercise sent to me by a, a subscriber. Now, here we go. And it says uh, the length of a road is 380 meters, correct to the nearest uh, 10 meters. Now, Maria runs along this road at an average speed of 3.9 meters per second. Now, this speed is correct to one decimal place. Calculate the greatest possible time taken by Maria. Okay, now what I've done here is look at the extremes. For 380 meters, correct to the nearest 10 meters, means that at one extreme, at one extreme we're going to add uh, 5 meters. So this now gives us an extreme value of 385 meters. Now, I've put I've put in here uh, less than 385, okay? Because the actual distance, the actual extreme value should be uh, 385, sorry, 384.9999999999 meters, which is near enough 385, but not quite 385. Hence, less than 385 meters. Now, at the other extreme, uh, we're going to have minus uh, 5 meters, which then gives us an extreme value of 375 meters. So, the, the uh, smallest value has got to be greater than or equal to 375 meters. Okay. Now, similarly for the speed, uh, again, similar thing again, uh, and this the speed is correct to one decimal place. So for the right hand extreme value, we're going to add 0 0.05 uh, meters per second, which then gives us 3.95 meters per second, less than 3.95 meters per second. Again, it's less than because the actual value should be 3.94999999999. It's near, it's near to 3.95, but not quite. 3.95 meters per second. Now, at the extreme, uh, we're going to have 3.9 minus 0 0.05, which then gives us 3.85 meters per second. It's greater than or equal to 3.85 meters per second. So these are extreme values. Three points, sorry, these are now our extreme values. So to find time, we divide distance by speed. So I now create a table here, which lists all the extreme values for uh, distance and speed. Now, if we take this column by column, if we look at this column to start with, this column here, okay, start with this column here. Right, now I'm going to divide uh, 375 by 3.85 meters per second, and that gives us a value of uh, 97.40 seconds. If we then divide 375 by 3.95 meters per second, I get a time of 94.94 seconds. Now onto this column here, this one here, I'm going to divide um, 385 by 3.85 meters per second, and that gives us a speed of 100 uh, seconds. I then divide 385 by 3.95 meters per second, and I get a value of 97.46 seconds. So these are the possible values uh, for the extremes. Uh, so we've got uh, so that so these values range from 9.4, so 9.94 at the minimum end, and 100 seconds at the other end. So the greatest possible speed that Maria takes to walk this distance is going to be uh, 100 seconds. And that should be our answer. Thank you for watching and please please subscribe and hopefully see you again sometime. Bye bye now.